the hunt for a suitable housing solution continues and this week we are looking into housing solutions in the parish of manchester nestled in the cool hills of mandeville is the perth estate it will consist of two bedroom houses and service lots so if you are interested in buying a house in that section of the island this is definitely the video for you if it's your first time here welcome to my channel my name is kayla k keen and on this channel i call my subscribers future millionaire so you are a future millionaire if you have not done so already hit the subscribe button over there and if you have already then simply like the video comment and keep watching for staying future millionaires before i go any further let me remind you though of my program schedule so i post a video every friday at 3 p.m and i live stream on sundays at 6 p.m so at that time you can come onto my channel and live chat with me ask all your questions about finance and real estate personal or otherwise anything at all you want to talk about i facilitate that on a sunday at 6 p.m so now that you know about my program shed let's talk about perth estate so as i said before the development is expected to consist of two bedroom houses and service lots the houses will be approximately 840 square feet while the service lots will be just under 6,000 and 12,000 square feet respectively. The development is located approximately five kilometers from the town of Mandeville and will offer you access obviously to social amenities. Here's what the NHT initially said about this development. The National Housing Trust is committed to helping contributors realize their home ownership goals by providing them with housing solutions and loans to buy, build or repair their own homes. NHD contributors in Manchester can look forward to Perth Phase 2, which will boost the housing stock in the parish by 1,314 housing solutions. Nestled in the cool and salubrious climes on the outskirts of the capital Mandeville is Perth Phase 2. This centrally located community offers easy access to the business hub while at the same time provides a tranquil environment to call home. Phase 2 is a part of the overall Perth housing development. 258 service lots have already been delivered in Phase 1 and 356 solutions are expected to be delivered by 2019. A unique feature of the Perth housing development is that homeowners will get to practice rainwater harvesting a move that the Manchester Parish Council had approved for Phase 1. Other features include paved roads and sidewalks, stormwater drains, central sewage treatment and disposal, portable water network, electrical distribution system and street lights, street names and traffic signs. The units at Perth Phase 2 are designed with reinforced concrete and allows for lateral expansion. These homes will have timber frame roof with alu steel sheeting, smooth rendered painted internal and external walls, ceramic floor tiles and wall tiles in the bathrooms. The fixtures for these units can best be described as modern, outfitted with sliding windows, metal exterior doors and hollow core plywood internal doors. The kitchens will feature stainless steel sinks and the bathrooms will have vanity complete with basin and faucet, enamel bath tubs and water closets. To create the ideal sociable atmosphere, Perth 2 will have recreational areas, lots earmarked for commercial activities, ample parking and other social infrastructure. The NHD, providing more hope for home ownership. If you like what you've seen so far and you are an eligible National Housing Trust contributor, then this could be the development you have been waiting for. 
remember when you purchase a house you don't only buy the house itself but you purchase the community you purchase the parish manchester is actually a very good parish to purchase a house in because the houses have great resale value and it is known as a parish for returning residents which give the parish some level of notoriety so this could be something that you should invest in. The Perth estate is scheduled to be completed before the end of this year. So if you are interested in these houses or service lots, remember that the NHT normally opens application prior to the completion of the houses or preparation of the service lot. So once they are listed, then they'll go ahead and accept applications prior to the completion. So if you are interested, this is the time for you to start preparing yourself by getting your pre-approval letter from the NHT. Remember that getting your pre-approval letter is not difficult. All you will need is your three last pay slips, your NIS and TRN number, and a job letter from your company. If you are self-employed, however, please have your bank statement prepared as well as your TRN and NIS numbers. Visit the office and then they will prepare the letter within a week for you. Additionally, remember that additional funding is generally garnered from the bank. So go to your bank when you have gotten your pre-approval letter from the NHT and let them tell you how much they are pre-approving you for in the form of a loan so you know your affordability. It is important that you do that from now so that you're not scoring for all of this when the property becomes available for application the cost for these two bedroom houses has not yet been made available by the nht but remember that the nht provides 100 percent finances for their scheme properties using their point system as one of the main guides to who is selected so once you are qualified to apply for an nht scheme Go ahead and try your hand at this scheme. When the cost is made available, I will do another video. And I'll also do a video when applications open. So just keep it in the back of your mind for now as something that is upcoming. Remember that houses go really fast in Jamaica. And when the NHG opens application, it usually closes within three days days so if you have not subscribed to my channel i suggest that you do that so you don't miss an update additionally if you have not clicked the bell that means that you will not get a notification on your smart device when i upload a video which means that you could miss your opportunity at owning a brand new home so like the video subscribe and hit the bell so just a quick recap firstly the perth estate in manchester will consist of two bedroom houses and service lot secondly if you are an nhd contributor this might be the perfect opportunity for you to own your own homes for my subscribers who do not yet have their pre-approval letter go ahead and apply for your pre-approval letter from the national housing trust all you'll need if you're employed to a company or an organization is your last three pay slips your trn and nis as well as a job letter if you work for yourself you're going to need a bank statement to prove that you have money to pay your mortgage if you are selected and you'll also need your trn nis to submit to the national housing trust once you submit those you'll get back that letter within a week so you're going to go to your bank give them the letter and whatever information they ask for usually at that time they'll ask you to do a credit report so you'll go ahead and do that also 
and you will know how much you qualify for as a loan once you have all of that you are now waiting for the nht to open application so that you can own one of these homes or one of the two different sizes service lots that they have i am totally excited about this and i will update you in another video once application open or once the houses are completed so additionally remember to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so what are you really waiting on though yeah man subscribe hit the red subscribe button over that side of your screen so when you subscribe you don't miss a notification and additionally hit the bell guys hit the bell Remember to like the video, share it with a friend, and help me on my journey to 2,000 subscribers. It was my pleasure serving you as always, and see you on Sunday at 6 p.m. for the live stream. If you have questions, write them down and come chat with me on Sunday at 6 p.m. EST. For my subscribers who are abroad, remember it's 6 p.m. Jamaican time, so don't miss it. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. And until my next video or live stream, stay financially literate. Bye-bye.